So today, when I pull the spark plug out, I'm going to screen record on my phone what we see. But I'm curious to see if we can make out exactly what piston. Because the seller said it had a stock bore cylinder and a stock bore Wasco piston. We should be able to see the markings on top of the piston. So hopefully the camera resolution will be decent enough to where we can make out the numbers or physical makeup of the piston in this motor. All right, so I didn't realize that this little camera thing does not record audio. So we can do a little voice over here. So this spark plug hole is, you know, in a blind spot. So you just gotta kinda blindly find your way in there. Uh, but once the camera get in here, the camera does have decent resolution and we can start to see our first set of numbers. So it seems like there's two rows and I can see a 4606 and then right under it very faintly, I can see a 63. Um, so going to kind of adjust the brightness of the light, see if we can make out some more numbers and I can, if you see behind that six, there's an M and a zero. And then on the bottom, you can see that it is 63. Four zero, so we are getting a little bit better and you can see that there's some more numbers behind the mo so look at those cylinder walls those look pretty good so this seems to be a pretty fresh rebuild so i mean that makes me feel a whole lot better but it does have a niche head on it but look, the cylinder walls look good looks kind of dry so we're going to kind of mess with it some more and you can see we see a eight five and it's another numbers behind the 8.5, but I can't quite make it out. I don't know if that's carbon buildup or what on the um, on top of the piston. But there is an 8.5. But no matter what, I can't quite make out what is behind the 8.5. But hopefully, with this many numbers, it should be pretty easy to hopefully find which piston this is and hope that the seller actually did put a wisco piston uh in this and again it's kind of readdressing see if we can find it but hopefully this will be enough information so let's head to google and let's see if we can identify this piston all right everyone so i'm just going to take uh what we found and we're going to drop it in google if you're not subscribed to the channel yet, subscribe. All right, so let's see what we can find here. Uh, Caster Depot, no. All right, so let's take off. It was eight five something. Oh, okay. So right here, four oh six. Okay, so I guess the two numbers we could make out was a zero zero. So hopefully this looks like it might be a actual, a, a actual, a actual Wasco piston. Not going to Amazon, SoCal, Dennis. Dennis Kirk is pretty reputable. So dirt bike. All right, so we have Dennis Kirk. Can I get a picture of top of the piston? Uh, Forge 606 M0 850 bore size 85 millimeter. Is that stock bore? Uh, so what is stock bore? Is stock bore 85? 85 okay so it is a stock bore wasco piston but i want to see let me see fitment honda trx 2006 2008 four tracks 99 okay so it looks like it does have a wasco standard board piston but i would like to see the top of the piston Oh, so of course that's not an actual Honda piston. I don't want to go to Amazon or eBay. I kind of feel like Amazon and eBay might not be the best place to look for stuff. But I can't find the top of the piston. 
All right, what about Wasco's website? I really want to verify that the piston that I am looking at is an actual Wasco piston. So let's put the information here. All right, now I want to see the top of the piston. So the piston is MSRP. Uh, manufacturer suggested retail price $196.71 uh, they have it on sale or whatever for $172 this is the number that we saw on the piston so this is on Wasco's website and I want to see nope I don't want to sign up I want to see the top of the piston yep and that's what it looks like 40606 MO whatever it was 9 or eight five no this no yeah eight five zero zero six what does that say six three what do we have six three four oh one I think is what I saw it says six three something 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 but that seems to be the piston that we have and it has the four releases around the edge look like and everything so yeah it actually does have a Wasco piston so it has a $200 piston for the top end kit and then it has a And then it looks like the cylinder is 50 bucks for 85 millimeter stock bore cylinder. So you got a $200 piston, $50 cylinder, so $250 and the top end is rebuilt. So that is not all that bad at all for a top end kit. So, at least we know, well, at least I know, that we do, in fact, have a Wasco piston um, in my 400EX. And if you buy something and you need to verify or you want to verify what piston that it has in it, then you can get um, one, of those, one of those little cameras like I have. And you can verify it if you want to look at the cylinder walls anything like that you can do it so I will have a link in the description below uh, to Amazon for my little camera and I'm going to finish editing this video and get it out to you so like everything I always say think build enjoy I will see y'all later peace